Welcome back to First News Sunday. We're starting a new segment on First News Weekend called Spotlight Sunday, and we're shining a light on organizations within the community that are helping you shine bright. We're meeting with three sisters with Marshawn and Hannah this morning. Good morning. Thank you for being here with us. Good morning. Thank, Thank you, for you for us. Yes. So start by telling me how did three sisters come about? Oh, um, so good morning, Omaha. <laughs> Three Sisters came about of three women who had become of a certain age and we talked about the troubles we had when we were growing up and the problems we ran into and we saw in the community that we needed and we were looking for. So we decided to make that. And what are some of those problems you were looking for in the community that you decided to make? Trouble making it till payday. Um, trouble with like diapers running out and it's Thursday, you don't get paid till Friday. Gas till you get paid. Food till you get paid. Not enough daycare little things like that, food at the end of the month, or in the summertime when the kids are home, there's nothing to eat. So we just decided to be that. And Hannah, talk about who receives these services that you guys provide? Yeah, so the community actually receives these services. Um, anyone can actually come into Three Sisters, um, and we have a free on-site printer, um, computer that they can use. Um, we have a pantry as well, baby products, um, numerous other other um, things that we actually help out in um, the community. Um, a little bit about also some business basic classes. I don't know, Marshawn, you want to talk a little bit about that yeah, as well? Yeah, we offer all of the basics that you need to get started going back to work. You know, since the pandemic, a lot of people are looking for work again. Uh, we do like pitch, uh, what is it, uh, elevator pitches. We teach you how to do a resume, get you signed up on LinkedIn. You know, you know there's a cost to use a printer nowadays. Even email services aren't free. We do all of that for you for free. And you talk about business basic services, you talk about diapers mm -hmm. and all of these resources. Why is it so vital to offer these services, especially where we are now when we're seeing, we're still seeing inflation rise and you know, the cost, people just can't afford it. Everybody is affected today. Mm -hmm. Everybody, there's no one who's left out. It's so important. You know, you might be getting paid, but it still just isn't enough. 99% of our people are working. It's not that they don't have a job, they just can't make it with the, their ends are just not meeting. So it's just good to have those there. We have no barriers, there's nothing you need to come there, just be in need. And I know that with diapers and stuff like that, you do have stock somewhere, or how are you getting these resources to you, or where are you holding them? We have a storage facility, but people donate. We have great people who have just donated thousands of diapers to us. We have diapers, baby wipes, formula, bus tickets, gas cards. All of those are donations that we have. Um, through our sponsors and just people in the community who just said, hey, you know what, I've got a ton of baby food, can I donate? Now, for a woman who may be watching this, who say, okay, I want to receive these services, where can they go? Do you hold events or is there a center that they come to? Yep, 1941 South 42nd Street. We're in the Center Mall, fourth floor, suite 402F. We're open 12 to 4, Monday through Thursday. They can call ahead, call ahead for the um, gas cards, but everything else is just simply walk right in and just need it. And we talk about the people who are receiving these services. What about the people who want to make a donation? How can they do that? Yeah, sure. The, um, they can actually go to our website or yep. our Facebook page as well. And yep. um, we do have our PayPal link on there. Nice. And we do have all that information for you. If you want to get involved, you can find more information at 3sisters-omaha.com. Thank you, Jonah.